though, in preparation for One Piece film Gold, I am going to be doing a live reaction and review of every single One Piece movie. So today, we are starting off with One Piece the movie. Yeah, like the original movie from 2000. So yeah, let's watch this. Note, my reviews will be, it'll be harder to review because it's older. So the information given it will be kind of contradictory and it's like so non-canon it will hurt, but whatever. Let's give it a try. I don't even know when to take place. I've never seen it before. But yeah, let's step back and watch. In the East Blue, so this is way back. There's a man who was a great gold pirate. His name was Woonin. Woonin? And countless hard battles wouldn't wash many enemies of their gold. And it had it that he stole a pile of high a pile of tied them out and lit the oven. However, over the course of a few years, in the distance faded. The great gold pirate came off his <coughs> <coughs> So many no name pyre for me, but they're okay. That looks like the original map of the Grand Line that I would have drew. Just modified. But okay, whatever. Rat up. Let's see, we're talking about Rat Top. Oh, great children. Oh, God. Great. Just damn children. Yay. What the hell? Ghost ship? Okay. Whoa, whoa, this is back when there was like blood in One Piece. Wow. Look at the good old days. Remember the good old days when you were blood in this damn theory? Like when Delphamingo like would have killed all those people, like it would have been blood everywhere. Wouldn't that have been nice? Guy looks like it's a, like a fusion of a super Saiyan god, Shiki, and I don't even know. Oh, we are! Okay, I'll take that. I love this opening. And so many men head for the Grand Line. Hmm. Oh, we are! You're playing the We Are opening! We're gonna draw- oh, we're not. We're gonna draw- we're gonna head out on- to see on a journey. <coughs> I'm sitting with- right after Uta joined. You don't have Sanji yet. But okay. But he's still in the opening. Whatever. I don't freaking care. I got a message on YouTube, but I'll, I'll reply to it later. Nah. I so they've been making nearly an hour. Oh, they look way back where they had like sound assessing we are. I'll never understand why Nami hitting somebody in the head with a wooden stick sound like that. Could they not find the sound for some chick hitting somebody in the head with a wooden stick? Could they not find the sound assess for that? Okay. Whatever. <coughs> also, I can point out, I love how Dragon is in this opening. That's how far ahead Oda was thinking. Oda was like, you gotta put the guy in the opening. See the guy? Want him in the opening. <coughs> and we didn't even know he was his dad at this point. Like, this is really far back. Yeah, reviewing this is gonna be hard because I'm gonna base it off of what I know about the theory. So they have been married. I'm not reviewing the OVA, that's too much. And, too much. and some of the OVA that are recast, they're just not worth it. I'm starving. The last time we ate was a week ago. Luffy could not go a week without eating, I'm sorry. That's how I'll go tasty.
So, judging by Nami's clothes, I can gauge this and Sandy not being there. This is in between, this, this movie takes place in between the Syrup of Village arc and the Barate arc because Nami's obviously still hiding her Arlon tattoo. I don't think I reference that at all. <laughs> if I'm editing, don't care if like that. My nurse, I'm just thinking, I got it. Finally got it. Who fault did it that we are all starving? I worked so hard, I worked very hard to store one month worth of food for this long journey. And who ate it all? Who ate it? Who exactly ate it all in three days? Now, I know, I know, I'm no force, I know, I can't say into the future, guys, but I'm going to assume Nami is going to blame Zora. Yeah. Oh, it was the Two days. Uh, <laughs> I hear like a pounding. I don't know what that is. Pathetic. I was an idiot. Why did I look like an idiot? Oh, hello. I don't know where the label are. I mean, that's it. I mean, that's it. I mean, that's it. I mean, I, the voice actor definitely got better. Like, when Nami does that, like, demonic face, now it's a lot. You can see, like, that uh, there's more emotion in it. In this, he just plays, like, a no emotion. Like, the voice actors have definitely improved. They're not good. <laughs> and now they are that little. That's what I told you in the first place. Little bit voice that there. You remember back in 2000. Amazing. Come, come. Rocket. Fail. The dad thing is, this is not too much better at this now than it was that then. It isn't much improvement at all, actually. He's an idiot. Crap, I jumped too far. What the hell is this guy? It's like his body made of rubber. <gasps> genius! That's the kid on the other land. That guy is genius. I tell me he's a Delafer user. I was gonna make a video about this, but Delafruit users in the East Blue are for some reason a big deal. When they're no big deal. What are you doing? We need to be careful. That. Wait, is Thoros. I swear to God, is Thoros a pussy in this? I'm really pissed. But okay, a beam of light. He's all who could do that. Uh, 
uh, caught by Eel Drago and forced to work. I don't know where to find the gold. The kid story sounds familiar. We need to get a treasure, join the pirate crew, pretend, but the pretending is that that's an act to get to know itself a member. Sounds a lot like Nami backstory. Did, it, did the guy run away with parents too? Considering judging by the place the anime is probably at when this movie was made, the Arlo and Park arc were probably going on, so it wouldn't surprise me. I wonder if my room is. Oh, then? Again, though, really. So the name of that guy for not being blown. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. Okay, well, what's the resort at the beginning of this theory to try and to murder his castle? Uh, how this movie get better? More entertaining. And he's sitting pretty strong, right? I thought he died a long time ago. Hey! Yeah, yeah. This movie boring. <laughs> oh, I can do it like her. What are you thinking? Look at I'm getting the king of the fire. Well, they're gonna turn one piece. And then all the king of the fire. Actually, it's only natural after you have uh, an Elijah and an Black Crow. Wait, wait, wait. That logic is flawed. If the Pirate King, wouldn't anybody that's in your crew become legendary? Then so why do you need to find a legendary man to join your crew? It doesn't that, make any sense. I understand that. Whatever. I'm gonna talk to you later. I hate theory. I love it, Barry. Treasure tab that he 
Okay, speaking of uh, gratitude, how much you would have bet Luffy will never pay Makito back that money he owes her on that treasure tab, and you know the tab. Anyway, he said, when I become the pirate king, I'll get do all this. He's never gonna do that. Want to know why? Then Nami's mean, not gonna let him do it. No way to give me a bit. <coughs> and Luffy the master eating run. My daily vocal training, of course, not ego. But I won't say that. Now the app by the map they wore something. In a decent movie, I mean, I'm excited. Yeah, I know there's a movie where Laura and Sandy have like a legit fight. Even though it's not post time gift. A post time gift fight between them will be ball. Nah, maybe we'll get one because of the whole current arc. That'd be pretty cool. Nah, I think it's their word. Not surprised. Did he just unintentionally impersonate Luffy for his appearance? No. So I'm going to be doing one of these for each movie and a review. My library, my review will be out later today. So you guys know. The grown him that he's a note that he thinks he's a big shot, but in all reality, I could name about 10, 30 characters. I could name 15 characters right now that could beat him. Not to think Whitebeard, Ace, Whitebeard, Ace, Marco, Jane, Jozu, probably Nami at the moment. Only okay, Nami could beat him. Usopp, Chopper, Frankie, Do Flamingo, Luffy, Sanji, Zoro. Lucy, Akainu, Tadaduke, Akainu, Alkiji, Sabo, Dragon, Jesus, Shiryu. I'm just listing names of characters that could whoop kick this guy that. I could have the ones that could have bothered me about these earlier movies. Characters talking like they're a big shot when they're really weak as hell. All right, they come back with Nami with a complete fist. Wow. Okay. Luffy would break. Luffy would break out of that kick. Beat that man up and grab the hat.
I was about to say, the road just cut your way out, then I remembered the rope, the chain are made of steel. <coughs> the road didn't learn how to cut steel until on fly during a fight with Mr. One. I have a hard time resetting my mind back to the beginning of One Piece. That's just nearly impossible. I'm just not capable of doing it. I'm trying to remember when he got the string did. I think, didn't Nami add that in, like, in the Alabasta arc when, you know, I think Nami did the string during Alabasta when she, uh, sewed in ancient Thievery card. But it's either that or Oda just added it randomly. as like, just to make things make more sense. <coughs> <coughs> and this is the key one into our or to your goal. Are you implied that the thing of are you implying that Lizzie's smart enough to, to pronounce the word ambition? You appear to be implied that Lizzie has a brain that big. I'm sorry, he's not smart enough. God, this is the Nami I... I like Nami after all, part. Right on the part, kind of a bit. To be honest. My audio being picked up, right? Right? Okay, good. My audio. My audio being picked up, right? Yeah. We're good. Or it wasn't there for a minute. <laughs> what, what does that mean? Okay, Canada marked out with our own hand. <sighs> I may not do the order though. I may do the amount of order. I don't know. This does not feel like one thing. It feels like somebody trying to imitate Oda, but it's just not working. Yeah, right, it was not. Nobody cares. Oh, stop, you're a terrible liar. Nobody, nobody believed your lies besides Luffy and Chopper. Sometimes Luffy still thinks Dougal King is a uh, different person to stop. I don't know if you ever found that out. You gotta cut that mouth in. Uh, Thor, that one from the east. from the blue, that's pretty impressive. Also, the art in this movie is really bad, I'm just saying. Then now we're lost. Okay. I'm really not used to the rope not being able to cut the deal. It's really annoying. I imagine you'll get hungry. And if there are tents that are caught being over to you, I mean, it, it, it really did. This is not a good movie. Yeah, Ryan Roger. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm 
เสียใจเลยOkay, I'm gonna put it down. Something you never understood about this theory. All right, it's how Nami worked for a guy with a、uh, 20 million bearing. Yeah, maybe Luffy had an extra 10, 10 million. That was why he was 30. So Nami worked for a guy with 20 million berries on his head. They were friends with a former warlord, and somehow he stole and did all these crimes for eight years, and just never given a bounty by the navy. I mean, I understand Nami crying prior to me joining the Luffy crew were really nothing compared to the thing the Navy is dealing with. Like they're right now, I bet you right now, Ace is like, Ace is like taking out an, like an half an army. Ace and Marco are like taking on Admiral just for fun. Yeah, but Ace is Ace is Admiral level. I swear to God, Ace is Admiral level. Video on that coming up. In a couple of weeks. Oh god! Are you gonna try to ask why you call her Nami? Why would you do that? That's stupid. And you're trying to make them believe you're people that you're not. Why use her real name? Same for you, Nami. Why call her Musa? I, you, I just whatever. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Really, it doesn't really matter. I'm really hoping that movie's better. You guys can tell I'm not enjoying this, but I'm already 23 minutes in. I'm not finished this movie. I remember right. I just like, oh my god, I'll be destroyed. I would have went and sold them the gold under the tree. That would be you. But anyway, then how did Nami figure that out? It hurt in my ears. <laughs> Sorry, I think it's goofy. Me, <laughs> I'm Luffy. The man who gets the keys of fire. The guy's had to be through. Okay. Well, answer, answer if you are. What are you talking about? That guy died a long time ago. You don't know that until you see him. And there's only one person that thinks he's still alive, and he may still be alive. Are you not the one to change you like that? The kid is an idiot. You're still the kid. I hate this kid more than Momo Noke already. The kid's a freaking moron. How how can one child be this stupid? How can one living creature be this stupid? Oh, Laura, yeah, Laura doing something. Let me know I'm actually good. No one stands you here. We have all the monster trio, but right now it's just the monster duo. And the weekly duo, I guess. At least Brooke is in here to get in the way. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Slight jab to Brooke, I know, but screw, but screw Brooke. I'm not stopping you. Damn it. Ooh. Oh, oh, look. Oh, I thought they became unchained. Never mind. People forget now that that's a great picking lock. Can you lend me some money? Why? Toby. Oh wait, that's Toby. Oh, I get it now. <laughs>
Seriously, what is that like begging? I keep on hearing. Funny I can't hear that. I'm sitting a little farther away from my mic than I normally do, but that's because I'm watching a movie. So I kind of chill like. And you know. Well, Nami did something stupid. I'll see if it'll be funny. Nami doesn't mess up, so it's pretty nice to see her screw up it. Nothing like that. For one. Idiots, but my god. Why are they climbing? Could it be a stretching way up? No, legit, why are they. I don't understand. Why are they climbing the wall? Couldn't they just hold on to their feet and he could just rocket them up? It just doesn't make any sense. The color scheme for Laura's hair is a little off in this, too. I just made up. I swear to God, there are so many things wrong with this movie. Deal, trust me. You might get to meet the Dark King later. This is nothing. Oh god, are we gonna slap that plate now? I could care less. And pretty much the same name of the guy for Nami Village, just he pronounced differently and said again, it's gone. No, that's not what a pirate is. I don't just... That's not what a pirate is. A pirate isn't somebody that steals... No, wait, wait. You, you, you're gonna travel the entire world, yet you're sitting around in the East Blue. Okay. Now, I'm sure you're gonna, man, part of the world is the Grand Line and the New World, and Paradise, New World, Mari Joos. So, I'm assuming you buy <coughs> world, you mean West, North, West, South, and East Blue. You feel really need to be more clear. Am I right? The Grand Line is not a band that you idiots say. Wow. 
once again. You like say you want to gather all the gold of the world. You're you're insinuating you, you're going to go into the Grand Line and become the Pirate King. I'm telling you now, Miss, you're not the Pirate King, and you're not going to be the Pirate King. Of course, of course you can. If you're going to be a pirate, you must be strong. Well... Well, you want to be a pirate, think a pirate's dangerous. Wow, you actually made me feel bad you're under that guy. In this in this movie, Luffy is either too smart or too stupid. They can't or they cannot find a balance. <laughs> no, you look so pissed. Luffy probably wondering what the hell is going on. Wait, why is the farmer? Why what? Why is the why is the Odin guy helping them? I don't get it. Why? What is he gonna gain from helping them? How can a pirate live somewhere? You're a pirate. You're you're one of the freaking government, the world government. They murder people for fun. Ah, I knew the second I saw that thing, I was like, that thing could be a secret compartment. And her out, right? Any idiot should know the find this. <laughs> a basement. I still don't understand how that sword thing works. I know other gym, I don't get it. It doesn't make any damn sense. Oh, this movie plot is so. not one piece. The Rago is talking about what's gold, what's to find the gold. That's a old legendary pirate named Odin's head. Name, they're not Odin, they uh, some old pirate head. Wooden. Odin, Wooden.
Okay, we're getting after the final fight. I'm only typed for this. I want to be able to get the guy there. Okay, ew. I get, I get, I get what he's doing, but it's still grow. That's still really disgusting. Have you tried Kanji? Uh, no, it's just a hell of a thing. That's like I'm his opponent. That guy, hey, that guy needs to be for Roanoke. That's the Pirate Hunter Roanoke Zora. Alright, the Zora would be only draw have any fame at this point. <laughs> There's no one more killed with the Thor, yeah. Meanwhile, with Mihawk. So, like, can we cut with the Mihawk right now and just show him, like, cutting an iceberg in half with a single cut? Can we cut the nap, please? Or maybe him firing that flash at Whitebeard, can we cut to that? <laughs> oh, that's a good joke. That's a good, that's a good joke. <laughs> <clears throat> These people are so ignorant about where the world works. They really are. Alright. I want to set my phone. Where's my phone? Give me the pride of building a sword. Without pride in your sword, you have a slight hesitation. And that flip moment, it's, it's a, a mass difference between you and I. Okay, it, it, okay. At least thank you to make Thor awesome. And wait, wait, there was blood earlier, but now with those of the only giddy, there's no. Okay, whatever. That fight was so anticlimactic. Not that they're probably so confident in Luffy's ability for someone who was about to uh, betray him in like. A couple of weeks. We're about to try him. If he doesn't think he can beat some guy with a measly 20 million dairy bounty. When this guy is going to go on to the state warlords like I'll kill Tigo Flamingo. Or whatever. <laughs> this is just me commentary, you know. It'll become less as we get further into the story. This is just a really old movie. Oh, we have the good, we have my favorite background music, though. We, I love this OST. OCA won a book at Devil Fruit. The Gumbo Gum, the Gun Gum Fruit. And now he became a rubber man, so he's a Devil Fruit user. <coughs> You're all just now figured it out. Oh god. Oh, blood. Okay, I like this. So Luffy does bleed in this. Good. Yeah. Totally. Ping oh, Gumbo Gumbo Pink Wheel. Alright, it was kind of like a not incomplete version of it. Gumbo Gumbo no Pink Wheel. He used it on Arlong. 
the reason I remember the Arlon Park a lot is because uh, that's the first arc where Luffy goes all out in the theory. And it takes place like literally directly before the arc that sets up Arlon Park. It's also in my top five favorite arcs. I love that arc. And I just get a chance to reference it here, which is nice. There's one movie, movie four, I believe, that really it looks to be really good, just not One Piece. I'm, I'll definitely do reviews of and maybe live viewing the film of uh, the and uh, Strong World, but I have seen them. They're pretty well now. <laughs> Look for your shattered gold with with, with uh, simple gum gum whip. Uh, okay, whatever. Okay, I already know what he's gonna do. Let's get a new Gumbo Gumbo no Baloo to redirect it. There are so many things wrong with it, but whatever. Well, we don't even know what that beam is. Is it like, is it like energy? Is it like a light? Well, it can't be a light, that'd be Kizaru. I'll record my review in a bit after I'm done watching. I need to take a break from this, though. This is, this is not very good. I also need to pee. I'll probably do like one of these a month because I know film goals are to come out in the summer. So if I do one a month, that should be good. Uh, it won't be like a monthly, like certain day every month, but it'll happen once a month. Like one, like one in this month, one next month, one the month after that, something like that. Where's this hat? It's probably the longest 15 minute movie I've ever watched in my life. <sighs> oh, that's it. That's not gonna say I'm a pirate. I don't know if you had Zoro in the back just smirking. I think it's back when Zoro wasn't like moody over listening to Mihawk. I venture to find the gold. 
This is what people thought the One Piece were going to be. Like, it would, there's a point where a lot of people were saying the One Piece will be something stupid, like the, like the friends you gather or the adventure to find it. Oh, no, literally, in an interview, Drew was like, no, no way in hell. He's like, that's never going to happen. It is, I guarantee you it's not something cheesy or stupid. It, it's a thing. Or like if Oda even said, the One Piece is something. It, there is no lesson bullcrap. The One Piece is a... It's going to be a thing. I guarantee it. He said that in an interview. If somebody asked him what the One Piece... Like, if he knew what it was, if it was going to be something like that, he was like, oh god, no. Please do not destroy this place. This is where I'm going to practice treasure sleep. It sounds oddly familiar. To your brother, what is it dying with no regret? I mean, this guy is no legend, I'm sorry. One of the great pirate, one South Odin. They have the same pride. I really. What are you stars for again? I don't remember. This movie so... This movie is so many different plots going on that don't make any sense. It's really annoying. So the Odin guy... The guy that sells the Odin, the pirate, are like related and just... I don't even... I'm not, I'm not going to make a review for this movie. It's not even very good. Why have been there so far? How'd they get them there on the shore? How? Who, who moved it? I understand. I had no- Nami could not lift that, I'm sorry. Nami could not lift that much gold. So of course I said three times they returned. <laughs> I'm, just, I, I, I'm telling you two right now, they don't want to meet the Straw Hats again. They don't. Because when the, when the Straw Hats do go back to the East Blue, which they ever do, they're probably going to be the most dangerous people on the planet. And they're probably going to have, like, Admirals and Yoko after their asses 24 7. I mean, they can just walk into the store and they can just within five minutes of talking, like, Kaido, Big Mom, and Blockbeer could all show up and be after these heads. You'll look at the Pirate King if they ever go back. <coughs> Not that Kaido, Big Mom, and Blackbeard would still be around, but that was just an example, obviously. Do not hold me that. I'm by no means saying when Lucy Pirate King, Blackbeard will still be around. I'm by no means saying that. Don't, don't hold me to that, I swear to God. It's okay, so this is a good movie, it's just not One Piece. It really, it did not, you know, it's no, that's the reason film gold, film Z, I mean, and, uh, that's the reason uh, film Z and Strong World are such good movies, because they feel like One Piece. They feel like a canon. They feel canon. Especially Strong World, because it's just, it's just the Straw Hat rescuing a friend and going on stupid adventures. But, uh, it's not the greatest movie, I mean, as a standalone movie, it's good, but it, it's not One Piece, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed my live reaction to One Piece, well, One Piece 2000, the movie. That's literally what it's called in English. 
There's some long, complicated Japanese name like there is for everything. I'm not gonna try to say it because I will butcher it and probably offend some Japanese person. Because I will just I will butcher that name so badly. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. My review will be up later today, along with, of course, my uh, more information on what I'm doing. But my review will be up later, and I'll be doing another one of these next month. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe for more videos. One Piece Nation, signing out. Have a great day, guys.